This movie shows how silver filaments are formed in crossbar devices and how we can control the filaments to get desired electrical properties. Crossbar devices are based on a very simple structure with only three layers, a top silver electrode, the amorphous silicon film, and the bottom inert electrode, in this case tungsten. In the beginning, there is no silver in the amorphous silicon film, and the device is insulating. As we apply a positive programming voltage, we can see small silver clusters are being injected into the amorphous silicon film, and the current can now flow through the silver clusters. As we continue applying the programming voltage, more clusters are generated, and they extend the filament from the silver electrode towards the tungsten bottom electrode. So by controlling the shape and the duration of the programming voltage, we can control the shape of the filament and get different device performance. When the voltage is applied long enough, the silver clusters fully bridge the top and the bottom electrodes, and the filament growth is now complete. This is accompanied by a large increase in current.